how to set up Google Docs MLA format. So first thing is go to File, which is located on the upper left corner of the screen, and then head over to Page Setup. Make sure that all of these margins are set to 1 inch, and then click OK. Now the frequently used font style when writing a paper is Times New Roman. So just click this drop down arrow button and select Times New Roman and 12 for the font size. So just click this plus icon to increase the font size. Double click anywhere on top of the paper to open header. Make sure to set the same font style and font size. Then click this align icon and select right align. Then type your last name, go to insert, head over to page numbers and select the first option. Then click anywhere below header. So all throughout the paper, the line spacing should be double spaced. So just click this icon line and paragraph spacing and select double. On the first line of the paper, type in your first and last name. Hit enter to create a new line and then type in your professor's name. Create another line for the course name and another line for the due date of the assignment. Now moving on to the title of the paper, click enter and then click this icon align and select center align. Now type in the title of your paper. For your title, capital the words except for articles, prepositions, and conjunctions. Now hit enter to create a new line for your headings and subheadings. So for this, all you have to remember is to be consistent. Then hit enter to create a new line for your paragraph. So remember that all your paragraphs should be left aligned and have an indentation. So just click this align icon and select left align. As for the indention, drag this blue rectangle to half an inch. Now all your paragraphs will start with an indentation. Say for example, you want to insert a new page. So make sure that the cursor is after the last word of your page and then go to insert, head over to break and click page break. Now you've created your second page. As for your citations, your citation should be in a different page. So click this align icon and select center align. Type in work cited, hit enter to create a new line, then click the align icon again and select left align. Then paste all of your citations. Remember that all of your citations should be alphabetically sorted and it should also have the hanging indention feature. So highlight all of your citations, drag the blue arrow to half an inch, then drag the blue rectangle back to zero. Now you have this hanging indentation feature. And so that is how you set up Google Docs MLA format. Thank you and have a great day.